They die from what is known as compressive asphyxiation, from the sheer force of all the weight of the bodies being stacked on top of them. This is exactly what happened to Axel. The immense force of the unruly and out of control crowd created by the defendants' gross negligence created such significant pressure onto his body that he could not breathe. The air was literally slowly squeezed out of him, sending his heart into cardiac arrest. When he collapsed, concert goers trying to escape their own suffocation caused by the crowd rush trampled over his body like a piece of trash. When emergency caregivers finally removed Axel from the thick of human mass, he lay lifeless on the wet, littered grass at the edge of the chaos. They worked very hard to restart his heart, but they failed. Axel died on the muddy ground of a concert that he attended for fun. Axel Costa loved rap music, and he loved the lineup that was going to be playing at Astroworld. But that love and that feeling was not mutual. Certainly neither Travis Scott nor his handlers, entourage, managers, agents, hangers-on, promoters, organizers, or sponsors cared enough about Axel to make even a minimal effort to keep him and the others at the concert safe. I want everyone watching to know that this could have been your kid could have been your kid. We will be filing a lawsuit on behalf of 35 plaintiffs. That number is growing. Our phone is rang off the hook. I think it's self-evident that this concert was planned incredibly poorly, that no regard was given to the safety of these young people at the concert, that there was no emergency response mechanism in place to help those who were in an extremist situation. There was not enough medical personnel, enough security personnel, and there were more people there than should have been there. The way the concert was set up, planned, organized, and the way things were ha that were, were handled once there was a problem, it boggles the mind. We'll be filing suit against the score more entities. These were the promoters, management, this is an entity that's been sued multiple times for this very thing. We will be suing Live Nation. Remember, it was Live Nation who in 2011 was sued because of stage collapse and killed seven people and injured 61 others. The case will be brought against Harris County Sports and Convention Corporation. The premises owner who worked with NRG was supposed to provide security and make sure the facility was safe. 